Oh, we have a great one today for you, folks. Take a look. 60 years serving up classic home-style Italian cuisine on the east side. The great food and spot-on Italian ambiance makes Luigi's Original a perfecto tasty Tuesday. Luigi's Original, an old-school Italian spot from the checkered tablecloth to the staff of Familia like GM Scott Palmer. You're only a stranger at Luigi's one time. It's tough to get a table at times at this Harrison Township hotspot. Always worth the wait, starting with the award-winning pizza with or sans sesame seed crust. The biggest thrill customers have when they ask for pizza is they want the little pepperoni grease cups. That's what, that's what really sets off our pizza. Uh, sesame seed crust. Apps or small bites or a little bit of this, a little bit of that, like the nachos Napoli. It's made with pasta chips and a cream sauce. It's got Italian sausage and black olives and peppers and scallions. Steak bites, calamari, uh, peppered shrimp, Cajun crawfish. The big bites or entrees at Luigi's on Jefferson include fresh seafood and raviolis of lobster, or butternut squash, and the lamb chops. All six of them if you're hungry. If you're not super hungry, there's an appetizer course that's three lamb chops. And it's either served blackened with Bernays sauce or a la Luigi, which is spinach, olive oil, garlic, feta, garlic, tomatoes, garlic. If you're on a first date, I highly recommend that you bring mince with you because everything here, even the desserts, have garlic in them. The owner put a lot of pizzazz into the wine list, the Michigan beers and bourbons. Those desserts don't really have garlic in them, do they? Tiramisu's are made in-house. Cannolis are delicious. Uh, we also make the creme brulee in the house. Oh, oh yes, 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 this yes. This looks amazing. I have to thank Dean, uh, the owner, for coming in today. I mean, just braving yes. the elements. You never know yeah. on a Tuesday when the weather is bad. They've got to get in here early, and boy, did they bring it Yeah, today. they did. What did All they right, bring? Let's, let's show you. Yeah, the pizza, obviously, is one of their staples, and uh, they have a, a sesame seed crust on the end by Kim, and I'll show you that in just a minute. But this is uh, the Luigi Special, which is just loaded up with that. Uh, this is Jason Carr's favorite. Shall favorite I type of pepperoni. The, the grease cup pepperoni. The grease cup pepperoni. Yeah. You gotta have Love that. Loaded up. And uh, in the middle is their cheese. And then, uh, Kim, you've got the pepperoni pizza that does have the sesame seed crust. Mm -hmm. mm. Down here in the front row, the nachos Napoli, which is those uh, uh, pasta chips with all of the nacho ingredients, which is sort of like a pizza nacho thing. In the middle, oh, it is one. the classic <laughs> linguine with shrimp. And then uh, Dean and the crew brought in some of the lamb chops. Some of their oh, fine wines goodness. as well. Did we and talk about the dessert? Well, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to Calm try. Down, Mouth is watering. <laughs> yeah. uh, the tiramisu, uh, again, made in house with the creme brulee. It is just, you know, you have to go there and experience the mm. quaint atmosphere, the uh, checkered tablecloths, and the conversations. As Scott mm. said, you're only a stranger in Luigi's one time. What's These their deal? nachos are good. All right, so uh, they open at four o'clock this afternoon, and and they're offering a tasty Tuesday special 10% off of your food when you mention Tasty Tuesday. You have to mention it and if you're thinking about going you may want to show up there about a quarter to four try to lock yourself into a table because mm. it can be tough to get especially on a Tasty Tuesday oh, but sure. they are right on Jefferson Avenue in Harrison Township again opening at four o'clock Luigi's. Mm. Mm -hmm. This is delicious. This is, <laughs> this is one of Henry Colby's favorite restaurants. Our teleprompter. Yeah. Oh, mm. Is it Love ever it. good? We'll get you up to down the stories to watch for after mm, the break as well.